Hey Cancer, we're going to do a quick reading for you guys. It's a bonus reading for the most October uh, 2021 views. So far you guys are winning and I thought I would give you a little surprise bonus. Congratulations, my Cancerians. Alright, let's see what's going on with you guys, okay? Universe guides, angels, and spirit. What is going on with Cancer, please? What does Cancer need to know? What is going on with Cancer? My Cancerian. What does Cancer need to know, please? There we go. We have the King of Swords. King of Swords and the Judgment card. This person who wants to come back, Cancer, they want to talk, speak their truth to you and perhaps talk about um, reuniting with you. Could be an air sign. Thank you. Now we have the King of Cups. This person has a lot of love for you. A lot of love. And gender doesn't matter, guys. It's the energy. A lot of love for you, Cancer. Another card, please. Squeaky, squeaky. Wow, the Nine of Cups. You make this person super, super happy. You're this person, which come true oh underneath the deck we have the two of pentacles this person may have been juggling in the past yes and the knight of wands underneath underneath that as well so this person was in and out of your life um probably because of the fact that they were juggling we have the five of cups they have a lot of regret cancer they have a lot of regret and they want to come back. They want to come back and talk to you and speak their truth to you. They want to tell you that they're sorry. They want to possibly see if it can work out uh, between the two of you. The sun. The sun. They now see things so clearly that you were the one who made them the happiest. Right? If they want to come in to speak their truth and tell you so. They see you as someone super loving. Thank you. Yeah, they want to take control. They may have been very controlling in the past, but they want to take charge now and come forward. Come forward as an emperor, not just a king, as an emperor. Wow, the Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups underneath here. Underneath. The Nine of Cups, I'm sorry. I just love these, these uh, graphics on these cards. Wow. What else, please? What else does Cancer need to know? Thank you. The Magician. I don't think anything's going to stop them. They're going to make they're going to want to make it happen. They definitely want to make it happen. You may have manifested this without even realizing this cancer. You may have manifested this without even realizing this. If this is something you don't want, of course you have free will, right? What else, please? What else, please? For cancer. Cancer, please. Wow. I feel like this person has a plan and they're not going to take no for an answer. We have the four of coins. You may, you may be a little guarded. You may hold back some. You may hold back from this person some and say, hey, dude, what or do that? You know, what, what, what's going on here? Why, why now? Right? We have the four of cups or the three of cups. I'm sorry. Another card of reconciliation. 
celebration, right? Could also mean again third party. There was a third party and they, you know, put you in, in the middle of it, didn't they? Yep, the Queen of Wands underneath the deck. So they put you in the middle of third party with the Six of Cups. There was no equal give and take, right? And the Ten of Swords, they hurt you dearly. They hurt you dearly, Cancer. And now they want to come back and give it another try. We have the Knight of Pentacles. You know, it's been a while. It's been a while since you've heard from this person. This person took their sweet ass time, right? Taking their sweet ass time. But they do want that victory with the Six of Wands underneath the deck. They do want that victory with you. Oh my goodness, Cancer. What else, please? For Cancer? Thank you. The Page of Pentacles. They want to come in with an apology. They want to come in with an apology. We have the Eight of Swords. They're going to use some excuse that they felt stuck in a situation where they were and blah, blah, blah. Um, the Three of Swords that they're hurting. They're hurting without you. I really feel this. I feel that they're going to you know, give you this whole uh, song and dance, which may in fact be true. Um, however, you know, the choice is up to you when, and how you want to handle this when they do come back. One more card, please. One more card. Thank you. The tower is going to shock the heck out of you. Well, maybe not anymore because I just told you, right? I just told you, <laughs> so this isn't going to shock you anymore, but you still will be surprised. You still will be surprised because you'll be like, what? Kit was right. What? <laughs> so just be prepared, collective, because this person means business. This person's coming back. They want to reconcile with you. They put you in the middle of a third party. They were in and out of your life. They could have been slightly controlling while you two were together. And now, you know, they know they hurt you. Now they're saying they're hurt because they felt stuck where they were. And that's why they it's taken so long for them to come forward to you. You're going to be a little, you know, standoffish. You're going to hold back some from this person, but I, I feel like this person um, definitely has, you know, a goal, and I feel like this person um, may not want to take no for an answer. This person realizes you're their everything. So, Cancer, this person's coming forward. You're going to have to let me know. Um, I love, love, love you guys. Here's your bonus reading, and um, yes, please keep me posted. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, Cancer.